guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing very, very well today. Today I'm doing a Primark Pretty Little Thing. I think there might be a boohoo item in there as well. Haul, basically. This was a haul that was meant to come out way back in February. So basically what I did was I went shopping in January. I got bits from Primark, Pretty Little Thing and Boohoo. And it was all for holiday clothes. But I never actually got around to filming the haul. I've still got all of the items. Some I've not even worn yet. But I decided to sit down today and actually do the haul because I've still got all the items. I know what I bought and especially right now there's not many like Primark hauls out there so it can give you guys something to watch. So I thought it'd be quite interesting. There's a couple of different shops in here and I think if you guys are anything like me you'll be missing your Primark fix. So let's get on with the video. So I'm going to start with my pretty little thing items first to just try to get a bit of order to it. So the first item I bought was this dress and I really do like this. still got the coat hanger on because I hung it for my wardrobe but I do love this dress. My only issue with it is the fact that it is quite tight. I had to get it in a size 6. And I'm normally a size 8 from Pretty Little Thing. But they didn't have any 8s. And I was in love with the dress. So I got it in a 6. So it's a little bit tight. I can't really eat before I wear it. But it's so gorgeous. It's so, so strong. It's amazing material. Really, really good quality. I really like it. It's called the Dark Wash Zip Detail Belted Dress. If anybody is wanting it. It's so nice. All the zips actually come down. Which I think is pretty cool. Because quite a lot of these things actually are like fake zips and that kind of thing, fake pockets. And this zip here comes all the way down as well, which is really, really handy for when you're actually trying to put the dress on. It's so comfy. I love the little collar as well. I think it just kind of adds edge to the design. But this is so pretty. It's so comfy. And I absolutely love it. So I've just had to scrounge this piece out of the laundry basket. So please do not judge me with how wrinkled it is right now. Because it is the most easy to wrinkle dress in the world. Oh, it's also inside out. So this dress here is absolutely gorgeous. I've got the same one in black. And I love it so much. It's so, so comfy and so pretty. And I really like it. So I had to buy it in red. It's only £5 as well. It's one of the, you know, the £5 section dresses. And I just really, really love this. I might get another one. Because I think they're doing another colour as well. But I'm not 100% sure. But I'm going to definitely have a look into it. I think the five pound dress section from Pretty Little Things is actually really good. I've got, I think, about five or six dresses from there and they're really nice. And you can like get like six dresses for £30 and you cannot go wrong with that, especially when they're really good quality and they're really nice as well and they're comfy and all that. So the next item I got was this jumpsuit and it's so pretty. It's so nice for holidays. This is such a holiday colour. Probably wouldn't wear it in the UK. But there's this one here and... I quite like how long the legs are because the legs actually start here. So you've just kind of got your bit of body there and then the legs are so long. And they're actually quite wide. I normally like things that are more slim fit and fit to you. These are like so wide. Look at that. That's literally like two times as wide as my head. As you can kind of see a bit closer up. That's kind of material it is, but it's really good. It's kind of got multi layers in it, so it's a lot stronger. Not see through at all. I just think it's so gorgeous colours as well. It's something you sit in the garden or on holiday, you go walking down the beach and it's so flowy. And I just, I think it's so, so gorgeous. It's so nice. I got this in a size eight and it's about perfect. I wore this all of the time when I was on holiday. It's amazing. I might have a look online if I've got any other colours or any other designs very similar because I would definitely buy this again. <sighs> Where's this from then? Let's have a look. So my next item here is also from Pretty Little Thing. This is a strapless dress and it's quite scratchy when you actually wear it. The sides can be a little bit scratchy, but they're not that bad. Uh, the inside's really, really comfy. It's really silky, but it fits perfectly. It's so nice, so pretty, so simple. I got this in a size 8 as well. Let me check. Yeah, I got this in a size 8 too. Again, it's was hung up in my wardrobe it just kind of looks like a really long skirt it don't actually look like a dress but it's so nice it's really elasticated here really elasticated but it's amazing fabric it's really good really pretty dress i really really like it on camera it just kind of looks really shiny but if you look at it up close you can see how it's kind of like it's not like glitter or anything it's actually sewn into the fabric if you look close <laughs> so yeah i do really like that item there Oh my god, my back is actually killing me against this wall. This is what happens when you like bulk film and you and I and everything all in there. 
so i'm pretty sure that's everything that i actually bought from pretty little thing i got one item from boohoo which was this bando um i got a few other items from boohoo as well but i think i did a boohoo haul at the time but i forgot to include this one so i'll show you this one now super cute really nice i've got the same top so I've got one, it's like a crop top, so it's got this, it's exactly the same, but it's got straps on, basically. This is so nice, it's such a good holiday feature, and it's just another one of those that you can just stick in a drawer and just add to your collection, just a bit more variety that you can wear, really. I love having loads of tops like this, crop tops, bandos, just tops like this, you just stick in your drawer. I've got lots of them. And the next one, there is a little story behind this, I won't lie. So this skirt is a size 4. I'm a size 8. I saw this skirt and it was on the sale rack and it was £1. And I was like, Mum, I cannot not buy that skirt. It's a pound. How can I not buy it? And I looked and I tried it on. I was like, there's only size 4. I tried it on. I was like, that actually fits. I've just got to have it a little bit above my waist. And it kind of just sits nicely on my hips. And it actually fits. It's amazing, amazing material. It's so, so soft. It's got a ribbed effect on it. And it's got these buttons that come down. They're actual buttons. They're not like fake ones. It doesn't have a zip or anything, which I thought it was going to, just with the way the buttons are, I thought it would. But it's so, so soft, so comfy. Look inside, it's quite, not velvety, but just really soft. It's really nice. It's such a nice, like, khaki green colour. It's a little bit brighter. It looks darker on camera, but it's a little bit brighter in person. And it's just so nice. It's just another skirt. You know, you've got your jeans and a top. It's a skirt that will go with those tops that go with your jeans, if that makes sense. It's just so nice. I couldn't not buy it when it was just a pound. I got another skirt too. This one comes with this black belt, which I really like because I'm really getting into belts more now. Yeah, I think belts are very overpriced because you're going to, you know, put a little thing and there'll be a belt I like. I like it. And then I'm like £15. It's how I could get a top. I could get like three tops from Sheen for that money. I just think it's not really worth the money that you can pay for them nowadays. So I do like it when skirts come with belts. So I can kind of like mix and match. So this one here was a size eight. I don't know how much it was, but I don't. I don't think it would be that much. It's about I don't pay that much for my clothes. I refuse. It's probably about like between five and ten pounds. It's exact same as the other one. Well, it's very, very similar to the other one. It doesn't have buttons. It's got a zip down the side. And it feels like quite a secure and sturdy zip as well, this one here. And then, again, I've got the belt, which I really like with the belt loops. And it's very, very velvety. But it's a very, it's a ribbed material as well at the same time. You can see my dog hairs everywhere. But it's a very velvety ribbed material. I really like it. That's how long it is. So I then bought two tops as well. I really, really like these tops. I'm getting into, I'm trying to buy more tops and more variety in tops because I'm just, I feel like I don't really have that much variety. I feel like what I do is I buy a top, really like it, obsess over it and then buy the same top in like seven different colours and that's pretty much all I do. But this one here is so nice. It's ribbed and it's black. This is what it looks like. That's the front and that's the back of it. It's so nice. It's got really, really strong and like extremely elastic. Look, look at that. That's like really, really elasticated. It's so, there's so much give to it. And they look really, really strong as well. And it's such comfy material. It's so like soft and kind of like fuzzy in a way on the inside. The outside is super cute. I love where it goes to on me as well. Because it's not like a proper crop top. But if I wore this with jeans, it'd still show a little bit of my belly. But it'd look nice. Rather than like showing like too much. This is so, so cute. That's what it looks like there. Kind of really got into denim lately. So, like, I got that denim dress earlier on from Pretty Little Thing. I've kind of been getting a lot more denim, like, dresses. And, you know, these ones like the ribbed effect, like this one here, you know, the skirt. I've been getting a lot of those denim and ribbed effect dresses and tops so i bought this one which i'm absolutely in love with when i first bought it when i first picked it up it was backwards on the rail so like that and i was like oh my god that's such a cute top i was like i'm oh gonna go get that carried it around with me took it to the changing rooms put it on backwards of course so put it on like that didn't i i was like it don't really feel very nice but it looks nice my mum looked at me from the back she was like you are wearing that backwards i was like oh thanks mum so yeah this is what the top looks like i love the shape the shape is so nice. Like I love the shape here, how it goes 
little curves there so nice it's got buttons on it but they are fake so they do not so the buttons on it do not actually undo they're all fake but they are so nice they say denim co and they're so so nice i love the straps i think it'd make it I think it'd make it a lot better if the straps were adjustable so you can make them like your size i think they're a little bit big for me and they do fall down a little bit but you can't always win them like you saw before there's a zip on the back to actually help you get into it and the zip's very strong very sturdy i love it's not really weird saying i love a good zip but without my coats and stuff my issue with normal coats a lot of the time is the zip will get like stuck in the material or the zip will just not work very well or just break that's my issue is i always have issues with zips so when i've got a zip like this it's really really good quality it makes you kind of want to more it makes you kind of want to buy more from the supplier if they've got products that like that and they're actually good quality and they're not going to break within 10 minutes of using them the straps feel really really good quality and really strong too there's not really any give to this though it's not elastic and it don't really stretch at all so you've got to make sure you actually get the right size i got a size 8 which is absolutely perfect and i really love this i think it's more of a summertime top though i think it's kind of the top that you'd wear on holiday but on an evening because if you wore it in heat you would seriously die but again you don't want to wear it when it's too cold either so i think it's kind of like the evening holiday style so guys that is everything that i bought last january for a holiday haul that i never got around to doing and i really did enjoy filming this i'm glad that i've actually got around to filming it I thought it was kind of like a waste of a shop and I did a try on back in like January which I'll be putting in between all like the clips and stuff so you'll see me trying them on which I filmed so long ago and yeah I just I really liked all these items I just kind of had to share it with you guys so thank you so so much for watching and I'll see you all next time stay safe guys bye